All right, all right, all right. Welcome back to WMAC Now with your host, Chuck Stevenson. Coming at you with some news out of one championship. So one announced uh, yesterday that their Adam Weight Muay Thai and kickboxing champion, Stamp Fairtex, is going to making, be making her return to MMA. That's going to be uh, Friday, August 16th in Bangkok, Thailand at One Dreams of Gold. So uh, Stamp came to into 1FC. She made her debut in a kickboxing title bout uh, where she defeated the then-champ uh, Kai Team Chuan. And then she went on to fight Janet Todd for the vacant Muay Thai championship. And then recent, her most recent fight, she de successfully defended it against Australia's Alma Uni Uniku. Now, uh, before she debuted in one, she did have one MMA fight at the One Warrior series where she defeated uh, excuse me Rashi Shindi via head kick KO at 19 seconds of round number one so this isn't Stamps first MMA fight but it's gonna be really it's practically her first MMA fight I mean 19 seconds that's not a lot of experience uh, her opponent is going to be India's Asha Roka now, Asha is currently 4-0 in MMA. She owns wins by TKO, uh, Rear Naked Choke, and Guillotine. She's finished all four of her wins. However, all four of those fights were in 2017. Uh, since then, she has been fighting. She has been boxing. I'm not sure of her boxing record, however. Okay, so it looks like one is making an effort to try to make Stamp an even bigger star. Uh, if you follow their website and app, you know, they release a lot of articles and they've been talking about, and some of them about uh, her possibly moving into MMA to try to become a three-sport champion. Um, I'm not a huge fan of Stamp. I think she's very overrated. I think that, honestly, I think her... I'll just be straight up. I think Stamp Fairtex... Uh, stardom is probably the most forced thing out of one championship and they love hyperbole they love to force stuff down people's throats but everything surrounding stamp is the worst I think it's just the most annoying crap ever uh, they let her get away with so much uh, rules and fractions in her kickboxing championship that she's never defended and then they straight up made the Adam Waite Muay Thai championship just for her uh, now they're bringing in someone that hasn't fought in a while to fight her in MMA. Anyway, that's really all I have for this. I don't want to spend too much time on it. Uh, we'll cover the fight closer, you know, when it happens. Till then, let me know what you think about it in the comments down below. Likes are always appreciated. And what are you waiting for? Subscribe to WM Macy Now, the best, fastest growing women's mixed martial arts dedicated platform on YouTube. And we'll see you next time.